a potentially life-saving diagnosis during a routine physical at a free agent visit to the New Orleans Saints. Tight end Foster Moreau learning he had cancer. Correspondent Ryan Bass is live. Ryan, he's putting his football career on pause for a bit. but and get back to doing what he loves. But that might not have even been possible without the thorough work of an NFL team physician. You know, I had the chance to speak to a doctor who has spent her life researching cancer. She hopes that Foster's fight becomes a national rallying cry. A routine free agency checkup turned into a potential life-saving diagnosis for NFL tight end Foster Moreau. The 25-year-old New Orleans native said on Twitter that during a physical conducted by the Saints medical staff, quote, I've come to learn that I have Hodgkin's lymphoma and will be stepping away from football. Dr. John Amos, the Saints' longtime team physician, helped make the diagnosis. The Mayo Clinic describes Hodgkin's lymphoma as a form of cancer that affects the lymphatic system, part of the body's immune system. They say it's a very curable condition, especially if caught early. We don't look at younger people as candidates for cancer. I mean, we just... We see that and have always seen it as a disease for the aging. Dr. Mona Javeri is the founder of Music Beats Cancer, a charity that hopes to increase the number of cancer fighting technologies to help those in need. She said we're routinely seeing cancer impact younger people, but the importance is catching it early. His cancer was found um, when he didn't have a symptom, right? But, but he found it. Um, that is profound. There's been an outpouring of support from Moreau since he opened up about his diagnosis, especially from his former Las Vegas Raiders teammates. Dr. Javeri says she hopes Moreau's early diagnosis brings more awareness to the importance of screenings, checkups, and mammograms, and that it'll inspire more people to take early detection seriously. To have somebody in, of his age and his stature and somebody who seems physically healthy and one would expect would be physically healthy uh, to speak about your health. I think it hit, hits home why screening is important, not just um, for certain ages, but for all ages. Dr. Javeri actually called for easier and more cost-effective ways for people to do screenings. That way they can catch cancer early and it'd be available widespread. As for that Saints team doctor, Dr. John Amos, this actually, Nicole, isn't the first time that he has had a life-saving discovery. In fact, he once spotted that ex-Eagles long snapper John Dornboss had an aortic aneurysm in 2017. That happened during a routine physical as well. He was hailed as a hero back then and is being hailed as a hero today, Nicole. Yeah, life-saving there. That's great. All right, Ryan, thank you for that. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.